What is up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. Thank you guys so much for checking out the video here today. <clears throat> um, let's get to the comment of the day, shall we? Here we go. Reach into the old bag. We pull out the comment of the day. It is coming from The Woosh. He said, can we appreciate the music in the arcades? Play those machines forever. Jay, I'll, jo I'll jam right over here. Wolves dance. Um, you know what? Whoosh. It is a little quiet, isn't it? I think, I think we can appreciate it. Dance in the comments, dance in the comments. Dance, dance, dance. Woo! 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 Ding, 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 ding. Da, da. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Uh, okay, well, I didn't really think about how to transition out of this bit. So we're awkwardly just going to stop the music and um, get rid of the gifts. And um, I didn't really think about the transition. Uh. Uh, Eden Street hard mode. Here we go. Trying to turn the 14 into a 15. Let's see what we could do. Let's see what kind of start we get. Uh, okay, we have the aura thing. We only have one heart and we have fire mind. I am and we have the explosive. This is a dangerous run This is a dangerous run right here boys. It looks like we have the speed aura because we are pretty damn fast We have a 1.62 speed. You might be saying Jay take the fire mind. It's a little too dangerous right now I I will take it I think but I'm out of breath from dancing. <laughs> I will take it. It's just a little dangerous. A little dangerous. If we get so hot or if we get black hot, I will take it. Do our due diligence. Shoot our poops as we do. It's scary. I'm not going to lie. It's a little bit scary. It's also scary that we have this strap to our chest here. I think we have a trinket that's pulling enemies towards us. I'm not sure if this trinket does that. It's just a coin magnet. Magnet. Okay. Okay. We shouldn't worry about it then. We unfortunately do not have enough money to access the shop. Uh, we also don't have a key to access the shop. So I guess it doesn't matter. We do have a nice little hat on. So there's that. You guys out of breath from dancing or is it just me? Is it just me? I don't think this will get to that rock. This is a bold move, but... Oh, I should have put it down there for potential secret room. Oh, it pays off! It pays off. You love to see it. Oh, you love to see that as well. Now we go back. Now, fire mine's dangerous. It's going to be dangerous throughout the whole entire run, but it is also a strong item to have. So we're going to definitely take it. We just got to keep our distance. That's very important. We keep our distance. Doo -doo, doo -doo. Let's see. Oh, okay. Oh, our range is not very good. The range is not very good here, boys. Good enough for us to not get hurt if we just play this right. Should speed up this boss fight significantly. So that's why a main reason why I picked it up. We could use a bomb as well if we want to speed it up a little bit more. But it's going pretty quick because of the burn effect. And he just walked right into that fire. It's going to be mom's heels. That's not great. We do have a key to access the shop, but we only have one cent and one bomb. I don't think it's worth it. We could check for a secret room, but the super secret room, I think, could be in too many places. Could be there. Couldn't be there. I don't know. Maybe we'll just check here. 
It's not. I feel like there's never a super secret room on the first floor. Maybe there's technically not. I don't know. I'm not sure. All right. Cellar two. Here we go. Bop, 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 bop. Bop, 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 bop. Just got to let them burn. Let them burn, dude. Oh. Explosive shot there. Interesting. <laughs> This is where a kid fire mine can be pretty dangerous. Spiders close the gap very quickly on you and then it blows up in your face. We still gotta be very careful because we only have two hearts here. We gotta be very, very careful. We don't wanna take any damage. I'm being very careful also to not shoot the wall next to me like that. I'm like pretty sure you don't get damaged by your own fire, but I wasn't about to take the chance right now. All right, we got a key. We have three keys, which is good. We can access both the shop and the item room on this floor if we want to. Shoot the fire just because it's one of those things where you ignore it, and then uh, it's the thing that hits you in the room. Do have a tinted rock here. Wow, that was really close to damaging me. Need a bomb. Just trying to keep my distance from everything here as much as possible. Set him on fire. This is dangerous. There we go. Get him out of the corner. Okay. Little Spidey. Got the little Spidey. Uh, forever alone. That's fine. We had this on the last run. That's totally fine. Let's see what's in the challenge room. We got to do it for the bomb. I'm sad. I'm very sad. I'm very, very sad. Now we have to fight two bosses. One being champion gurglings, which we did get through. The next is going to be Pin, which is actually a little dangerous when you got Fire Mine because he jumps at you. Okay. All right. No harm, no foul. I think we still want the coin magnet. We really do need a bomb. Could we sit here and shoot this until it blows up? I think. Maybe? Does it have to hit a monster for a chance to have it blow up? I don't think so. Is this a joke? Is this some kind of joke? Maybe it does have to hit a monster. <laughs> okay. I think we confirmed it needs to hit a monster. I could have swore I've... I've accidentally shot a rock and it's blown up before, though. Okay. Well, I guess not. We need a bomb. Very close. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Burn, baby, burn. Disco Inferno. Burn, baby, burn. This boy, don't close the gap like that. Come on. This room, this feels like it could drop a bomb, this room. I feel it. It's a key. It's a freaking key, dude. And then the shop also doesn't really make sense for us because we only have one cent. We'd basically be burning a key. <clears throat> Unless it's like that room. Oh, shit. That was really close. I'm, like, not going to shoot him when he does that if he's super close to me. This is where we want him. We get another range up. That's shit. To be honest, that's straight up shit. Okay, we're definitely going to take Empty Vessel here. It's going to give us two black hearts. It's going to give us flight. Okay. That was pretty good, dude. That was pretty good. 
I was gonna say, do we look for a secret room, but we don't have a bomb? Yeah, we gotta, we gots to go. <clears throat> we gots to go. That was a really good deal with the devil. That was maybe the best thing we could have gotten, to be honest. Uh, that will take us out of empty vessel. It will give us a speed up, however. And we have not gotten hit, so we still have a speed aura. Basically, this aura thing, that yellow thing around me, if you get hit, it changes. So it could be a tears up, it could be a damage up, it could be a speed up, and you get hit, and it resets. It changes to something else. So, I mean, I'm fine with it being a speed up. Obviously, there's better stuff out there. Uh, and the blood bag, again, it will give us speed, but it will take away our flight and empty vessel effect, which I think is more important right now. It's definitely a decision that I need to make. Then you also could say, you know, the, the red heart would be able us to, uh, allow us, I should say, not able us. <laughs> allow us to get a deal with the devil in the future. We would be able to. Might as well use the empty vessel effect while it's here. Now it could have been, that could have been bad if it exploded. Just the flight also makes fire mind a lot less dangerous because we have so much more mobility and obviously could fly over the, the holes in the map. All right, there's a bomb. Now we're looking for some sort of tinted rock because HP is still at the top of our list now. I mean, three hearts. We only went from two hearts to three hearts. It's not great. Maybe a decent amount of money in here. Hopefully not a trinket. Decent amount of money. Yeah, and a luck up. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. I don't know if the luck stat has anything to do with fire mine, but... A little gish. Stand over the void here. We should be okay. Not really anything these uh, guys could do about it. Do, 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 do. There we go. Just willy nilly once we get this. You know. The no trinket is, is fine. We just don't have a space bar item right now that I'm completely in love with. So there's really no point to take it. This space bar item we can't really do anything with until we get some sort of explosive invulnerability. We're going to check out the shop because we have 10 cents. We want a soul heart. We get a soul heart. There's also a nun's habit in here. I don't know if we want the nun's habit. Let's just do that and take the money for the road. Do our due diligence. We got to do our due diligence. That we're, at, we're in a tricky spot in the run where if we keep getting range ups, it's not going to be good. <laughs> I'll tell you that right now. Oh, little Gish slowed him down. I was like, wait, what? Thank you, little Gish. That that one missing page imitates the Polaroid effect. That could be really good, right? Probably. Might just have a chance to imitate it. Just get, in, get them burning. Okay, we have the uh, empty vessel. Honestly, pill's a little too scary. I think we're still at that point where it's a little too scary to pop a pill that we don't know because of bad trip. Bad trip would not be good. Sack. It's a troll bomb. Okay. We could go to the, the room. Let's just see what it says. Imitates Polaroid, the negative, missing page, and missing poster. Sure. We'll just take it. Seems better than the broken magnet. I don't know if I feel comfortable taking half a heart. And it's interesting because it would change our aura from speed to something else, which could benefit us. If it's like a tears or a damage up, it would definitely benefit us. But I don't know, it might be a little bit too risky.
a lot of fires. Stay out of harm's way. Okay, we're going to get another black heart here, which is good. Couple of bombs. And we don't want that. We don't want plan C. Okay. Uh I'm debating let we should we should probably do the let, let's do the the curse room here. We do the curse room and we reset our aura. Which, again, it could be to our benefit. I guess it could be to our detriment as well. What's the worst order to get? Range up? I don't remember the colors, to be honest. But if we keep an eye on our stats on the left, we'll be able to tell. So we don't get damage going in, obviously, because we have flight. Blank room. Oh. This is... Now, this got interesting. We don't have to... We don't have to get hurt. I'll keep the speed for now. And and I'm keeping half a heart as well. It just it just so happened to give us a path out of there, so we'll take it. Black heart, yes. I yeah, that's my bad. That's my bad. I trapped myself. Um an extra familiar or the Polaroid effect? Sure, we'll just take this. So we got damage. We got a damage up. For sure. I could tell. Damage up's great. We have two familiars now shooting with that trinket. We don't know what this is. It's a magic mushroom. I mean, we're going to lose empty vessel, but I'm not going to complain about a magic mushroom. We have a damage up aura, and we got magic mushroom, which definitely boosted our damage. So we can't be that upset about losing... Oh, that was close. We can't be that upset about losing the empty vessel. Could always get it back. Tammy's head. We just got to set some fires under this guy. He'll be dead before you know it. I guess we'll, ta we'll keep Tammy's head. I mean, there's no point to not. Other than maybe it's a little bit dangerous. Fire mine got me. Okay. Just got to be a little bit more careful. We're not out of the woods yet. That makes this run... Oh, I thought it was Bob's brain. Sorry. That's fine. Damn. Damn, dude. We got... Out of the four gold chests, we got three items. That's pretty wild, man. Okay. So we're back. We got hit, so we're back to the speed boost. Which, obviously, I'd rather be at the, the damage boost, but it is what it is. We also got head of the keeper, so we should be able to get some more money here. This room just seemed a little dangerous to get in there and use my Tammy's head, so I didn't. Yeah, Tammy's head, I think, might be a little too dangerous for this run. This is bad. I'm starting to take so much damage. This is bad. We just got to be... We got to play like we were playing. We got to play like we were playing, which is just very mindful. If we're mindful, things will be all right. Let's get him with the fly. Hey, jam out, boys. Let's see what aura we have. It's a range aura. So we hurt ourselves. This actually might be a good space bar item. So we're back to damage. This actually might be a really good space bar item to have. Bagged lunch. It's still it's still really scary, but Okay, okay, okay. We're fine. We just want to keep this aura for as long as possible. We have some uh, flexibility now, though, with uh, IV bag. And don't get me wrong. I like Tammy's head. It's just too dangerous with Fire Mind. I just wouldn't be responsible enough with it.
Oh, hi. Didn't even know you were there. Not to mention IV bag could also, you know, grant us money. I'm, I'm just being very careful of our tears. We don't know what it is. I think it's a little bit too risky to buy, but we will buy this and we will do this. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll be lame as hell at this shop if, if need be. And by lame as hell, I mean re-rolling and buying soul hearts. We're trying to, we're trying to uphold a streak here, you know? If I could trade a bomb and five cents for a soul heart, I'm basically going to do that every time. And the Curse of the Blind is, is kind of nice there because it's making us not even think about buying any shop items. That was very close to hitting me. Some more money. I guess we could go back and buy... That's going to hit us. Nothing we could have done about that. What hit us? That was bullshit! That was bullshit! He died over there and he's a slug spawned on our pathway? Nah, 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 nah. Crooked penny. It's not worth it. Tell you what is worth it. Paid a cent to reset our, our aura. It's range again. It's not good, but we could reset it. It's range again. <laughs> you son of a gun. Okay. Got the coin jarred loose. Um, all right. Well, I guess we just, uh, oops, curse of the maze. I guess we fight this room, try to get a red heart, doing our due diligence as we do. Try to get a red heart, and then we did get a red heart and reset our thing again and hopefully get something a little bit better. We have a heart down there, but it's okay. Speed is better than range, I guess. This could be a really quick fight if our fire mind does what it should do. Okay. It's just an HP up. It's good. It moves us farther away. From uh, where we want to be as far as empty vessel goes, but that's okay. That's all right. We're also, we have the chance to damage ourselves a couple of times and get the aura we want. It's a range aura. This room is hell for us. That room is insane, insanely hard for someone that has fire mind. We get damage, okay. I, I, it's a little try hardy right now just because I know how dangerous fire mine can be and if we're not careful with our HP It's gonna catch up to us and it's gonna catch up quick Unless obviously we get you know Pyromaniac or host hat or something like that where explosions won't hurt us then then we'll be completely in the clear but Until then We'll take scatter bombs, I guess it's not great, but it's something. Fly did all the work. We have 18 cents, so the shop is viable. Boom, boom, ba boom, boom. All right. Good thing about fire mine is sometimes with these enemies, you just shoot them anyway and hope for it to explode. Even though, uh, or light them on fire, I guess. Even though they got a little mask of protection. Could wait for our fly to come around. Set them on fire. There we go. The tears are getting sucked into the middle, as are mine. Oh, shit. Okay. Forgot about scatter bombs. 
<laughs> might it might actively be better just to avoid scatter bombs. It feels like they're not that good and they're just dangerous. Just get out of dodge there. Use our fly as much as we can. That was really nice. Okay. That's going to give us a heart. We could pick up the other red hearts. I mean, it's good to have red hearts so we could use IV bag to move our aura around. It's a sneaky good combo, to be honest. IV bag and aura. Hmm. BFF and Terracloth, both pretty dang good. That was scary. Um, I, I would want both of these. I'm going to take BFF because we have two familiars right now that are shooting with us. Gish and Isaac's head. And uh, if we get four more cents, I'll definitely go back for Terracloth because I do like it. They are burning. They are dead. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Nice. Okay, uh, yeah, the curse room's a little too risky for us right now, so we're gonna avoid it. 72% chance to get a deal with the devil here would be very good if we did. This is a tough fight, to be honest. Trying to run him through the fire as much as possible. Trying to keep my distance as much as possible. Okay. We did indeed get a deal with the devil. It's going to be enough for us to get back into empty vessel. And it's going to be another guppy item. Ha didn't we get one already? Or no? Maybe we didn't. Maybe we didn't. But. And we also can't really do the IV bag trick anymore. But that's okay. It's alright. I think it was worth it. Empty vessel. Very important. Flight. Always important. The random invincibility, always good. It just ups our mobility so much. And we also have BFF, so... Oh shit, I forgot to buy... Well, no, I did that for the comments. We left Terracloth, so you guys would comment that we left it. That's right, forgot. For the interaction, baby! There's no more misplays. It's just interaction. I mean, this is also very good with, uh, we have BFF and Cuba meat, and then we also have the invincibility from Empty Vessel, which combines really nicely, and, uh, we're just gonna donate. Okay, guess not. Hmm. I mean, we could buy BOGO bombs. I really don't want broken stopwatch. I guess we could take that pill we don't know. There's really no point to have a lover's card. It's pretty much useless for us with no red heart containers. Ooh, that's nice. Speaking of red heart containers, um, I'm not going to do that. I don't really want this. Uh, I can't even imagine a speed down right now without flight. I feel like that would be a double whammy. I don't want a double whammy right now. I think we're in a good spot. There's really no point to mess it up. We're going to hang on to Isaac's head. It's not the best trinket in the world, but with BFF, it is definitely a little bit better. Also, attack fly with BFF is nice. Really happy with that decision to buy BFF. Even though, technically, we could have bought both of them. I mean, we might as well full explore here. We've done pretty good on this floor already. We've already gotten the shop and item room, so I'm not holding out much hope for something super special. We do have the arcade. Which y'all could jam out to for a bit. I don't understand this guy, man. Um, okay. Sure. We'll take the old crap bombs. I'm fine with that. Building up a little bit of a bomb synergy. 
We have a guppy item, so I'm going to do it. Unfortunately, we're going to lose our uh, damage. Oh, we got range. That sucks. <laughs> that was not worth it. I'll tell you that much. Don't forget the scatter bombs. Scatter poop bombs. Wow. Our tiers are way smaller. Okay. Did take one damage there. We have a tinted rock, though. Just wait for it. Got a soul heart back. Not so bad. Really bummed about taking that damage. That was stupid. We do have IV bag. I mean, we could get, you know, a reset on purpose, but it's a little risky. Uh, That's probably pretty good. I mean, at least to... I don't think... Last time I did this, I did the mom fight and waited for the deal with the devil. I, I, I don't think that's the way to go. I think if we're gonna do it, we should just do it now and then we get the extra item room and shop. I know there's probably gonna be people that say, go fight mom's foot. But I'm actually not gonna. I'm not gonna. Because now we get an extra shop and we get an extra item room without having to fight mom twice. Yes, we're blowing our 30% chance of getting a deal with the devil. Uh, but mom's, mom's foot doesn't drop an item, so we're not missing out on that. We'll obviously get it eventually. It's going to be the Polaroid, but you know what I mean. Uh, I think that's the best way to go about it. I mean, it's very much up for debate what the best way to go about it is, but I, I tried the other way the first time. I think this way is smarter, especially with our run, you know? It's a, it's a scary run. Mom's foot is very close quarters. We're probably going to hurt ourselves a couple of times on it. And I don't want to take, you know, a bunch of damage. Especially when I'm signing up to do the fight twice. Chariot's probably better than double active item right now. I know a lot of people's favorite sound in the game is that rainbow poop. I, I throw the question to you. You guys comment down below. What is your favorite sound in the game? You guys know my favorite sound in the game. It's the golden bomb. You guys definitely know that. What's your favorite sound? Is it something simple like a key pickup? Because, hey, hear that? That's a good sound. That's a good sound. Nothing wrong with that. We only have two keys, so I don't really want to do that because we still need our shop and our item room. Okay. Is your favorite sound the sound of Isaac getting hurt because you like when I take damage? I like when we take damage too because we're back into the damage upgrade, boys. The damage aura. There's a Tears Aura. I swear to God, there's a Tears Aura. We just haven't gotten it. We haven't been lucky. I don't know if that's going to get both of them, but we'll try. It did seem like it. Half a Soul Heart. That's nice. And we get our Nickel. And that's another Penny. We're up to 57 cents. <clears throat> I'll always remember 57 as the old ESPN Sports Center channel. Isn't that weird? That's so strange. Like, it's obviously not been 57 for literally like 15 years. But I will forever remember 57 as the Sports Center channel. And I'm sure regionally it was different. Um, I know Nickelodeon was 44, TV Land was 45, Food Network was 41. Like, I'll, re I'll forever remember those channels. It's so strange. Like, nowadays the channels are like, you know, Fox would be 805, NBC 804 for HD and all that stuff. But I don't know. They're, they're kind of all over the place. But back when I was a kid, that's what it was. 58 was ESPN2. 68 was MTV. Used to put on MTV every time I came home from school to check Total Request Live, which, you know, I abbreviated more famously to TRL with uh, Carson Daly. I would always check to see who the number one video was.
take piggy bank, I guess. It, it, it doesn't really matter. The, the money doesn't matter. I mean, the fact that we bought piggy bank doesn't matter, and the fact that we spent money on piggy bank doesn't matter. It's just, at this point, after a certain point, money doesn't matter in this game, which is something I feel like they really should change, but I feel like I've uh, t spoke on that point enough. That was nice. Do 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 do. Uh, a little bit of a bomb synergy. Scatter bombs, glitter bombs, um, poop bombs. Our our guppy's hairball is huge. So was it worth it, the shop and the item room, to redo this whole entire floor? No. But that's the risk you take. That is the risk you take right there. I would say no, it was not worth it. I was going to say, it might drop some items. When the foot comes down, don't even shoot it. Because you know it's going to explode in your face. Did take damage, so rip our damage aura. Which is really unfortunate, but... It is what it is. Take the Polaroid, go down to the uh, womb. We could potentially use the Emperor right off the get-go here just to get uh, the womb one over with. It is a Curse of Darkness. We have a range upgrade, which sucks. We can see what's inside this. Range down, <laughs> hilarious. Yeah, I, I think we just, we we explore this and we save the Emperor for the next floor. I mean, it's always a shame when you say that and then you end up finding an Emperor on this floor. Also a shame when you say that and you hit two dead ends right off the get-go. It's okay, though. It's all right, though. Better late than never. I don't know why, why that would apply here, but, you know, you just say it. More soul hearts drop. I mean, that could be pretty dang good. I just don't know how much better it is. Like, is it worth losing Isaac's head? Sure. F it. Retrovision, Curse of the Darkness. Rest in peace to the viewers. I'll see you guys on the other side. See you on the other side, boys. We might have to postpone this episode. I might have to cut it. I mean, it's getting close to my dentist appointment, and this is uh, this run's gonna take a little bit. We might have to. We might have to go to the dentist, come back, and finish it. I don't want to be late for the dentist. That's not a good look. Thought I could squeeze in this episode right after the last one, but uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know, dude. Gotten gotten a little close. Cutting it a little close. Also got to download the podcast that I'm going to listen to when I'm at the dentist, which is going to be the Crystalia Congratulations podcast. It's the only thing that makes me happy in such a terrible situation in a, in a the dentist chair. Thank God for Crystalia. Not going to do that. I mean, I think we just use this on the womb, too. The Emperor card. We do this. I was going to say, hopefully get some soul hearts, and then we'll take damage, and hopefully... Okay, we got the tears up. I knew there was a tears up one. We got the tears up one. It's a blue aura. Should burn to death. God damn, I can't see anything. What a hor What a horrible thing. Retrovision, Curse of the Darkness. Just why? 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 Why is this even in the game? Okay. I mean, this is one of the... I'm going to say this and take damage. But this is definitely one of the easier womb bosses. Okay, we're going to get tears up here, which is awesome. I mean, working on that bomb synergy. We're not going to take either of those uh, 
I think I just saw a tin and rock before I left. Uh, not gonna take either of those deals with the devil. Curse of the darkness again? Why you do this to me? Why have you forsaken me? In my eyes, forsaken me. Obviously want to do everything in our power to keep this tears up aura. Tears up aura is it, chief. A lot of the times you talk to chief and it ain't it. But this is one of those times where it is it, and that's unavoidable damage. Thank you very much, Edmund. I appreciate you. Unavoidable damage. Very fun. Very fun. Um, I love both of these. I mean, Sin Robes is free. Rotten Baby is just so damn good. Oh, you know what, dude? I don't think... Fuck. Well, one, I probably shouldn't have done Rotten Baby. Two, Rotten Baby doesn't get any buff for BFF. Rotten Baby only works strictly off Hive Mind, which is a, a pretty big L. Because there was, there was a second there I was like, oh, we should take Rotten Baby because we have BFF. But it, it is not true. Rotten Baby only cares about Hive Mind. That's all he cares about. We did get the damage aura, which is amazing. Empty Vessel pop in here. I mean, Rotten Baby's still Rotten Baby, you know? Golden chest. Okay. Go to, through this big room. I mean, mapping's gonna be pretty important here. One, to make it to my dentist appointment on time. Two, to win the run. Well, that's gonna be damage, and that's gonna be horrible damage. That's a full heart of damage. And we still have enemies on the room, even though we blew a black heart there. We got to look for a Tinted Rock. Am I freaking out? No, you're freaking out. Oh, I didn't see it. It was covered. God, no. That might have ended our streak. Guys, we're done. We're done. We're fucking done. We're done. It's goddamn rotten, baby, in the damn spike chest. Oh, God. I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. I'm not going to lie. I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out, man. I think we have one heart, which is one hit in the cathedral. I'm trying to uh, get a... Secret room, obviously. Try all the spots we can think of. That ain't it, Chief. Dude, uh, this is bad. I mean, one more sperm room and it's over. That's all it's going to take. It's all it's going to take is one more sperm room. They charge too quick. There it is. They charge too quick and we're too goddamn slow. A tinted rock. If this isn't a soul heart, it's over. Okay, it's a soul heart. Okay. Just be careful. Just be careful. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay, thank you, Empty Vessel. Really appreciate your patronage. Do that for a secret room, but also to break the fires. 
Okay, we got one soul heart out of that. That's not terrible. I'm trying to think where the super secret room could be. I mean, it could be attached to here. It could also be here. It is there. Okay. Black heart, please. Not a black heart. That's actually going to blow him up. Oh, we get a soul heart, though. That's, everything is fine. That's okay. That's all right. That's all right that he blew up. I mean, he could have given us a red heart, which may, I would have potentially taken, but you guys know where I'm, what I'm about to say about the, uh, the old empty vessel. The aura not being damaged or tears in this fight really sucks. But we were hoping for Empty Vessel to pop, and it did pop. All right. Should be okay. We have enough keys to access the four chests. We're also, we should find out how much HP we have. Okay, we have five hearts. Serpent's Kiss, one of the best items in the game. Blue Baby's only friend is takeable. Pinking Shears is an amazing space bar item. Really difficult to, uh, to manage that. But again, Serpent's Kiss already paying off. It's an amazing item to get. We do have Curse of the Law, so we have no idea where we're going, which is unfortunate, obviously. Sit Blue Baby's only friend on him. Oh, we have Empty Vessel. Do 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 do. I'm still a little nervous. I mean, one, we're cutting it close to, make it to making it to the dentist appointment on time. Two, <laughs> we're about to, uh, you know, perish the streak numerous times, and we're still not out of the woods. We have five hearts. It's still not in a completely safe spot, but hey, at least we're keeping it entertaining, right? 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 Anybody? Bueller? Serpent's Kiss. Serpent's Kiss. Oh, man. That is... That is huge. What can I say? That is freaking huge, man. Rip the frames. What hit me? Oh, hi. Hi. I didn't even see you there. Also didn't even see you there. Serpent's Kiss. You love to see it. We also get a Forever Alone Fly. That's a second one. We have two of them. Damn, Blue Baby's only friend. Very powerful. Sit him right there in between both. Because we got BFF. It's not a bad strat right now. Keeping us somewhat out of danger as far as uh, fire mine goes. I'm not using my space bar item because I want it for blue baby. I, and I don't know where we are on the map. I have no idea if we're getting close or not. One fire mine. Oh, we are getting very close. We are very close to blue baby. And I think this is going to be a W, boys. It, it was very scary there for a second. I think we were one heart away. Maybe two hearts away from... Um, Dying on the cathedral uh, is very, very nerve-wracking. But, hey, we did it, man. We did it. Pinking Shears is going to tear him up pretty quick. We can even sit Blue Baby's friend on there. And uh, it's going to be over before we know it. Just like that. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this one. 
Hope it got your uh, butt clenched and your heart going. And uh, I will see you guys in the next one. 15 win streak. We're starting to build something here. Shout out to all the Patreons on the right side, making it possible for me to do this. Shout out to all, all you guys watching, making it possible for me to do this YouTube thing. And uh, liking the video, commenting, and interacting. Check the top left video. That is a YouTube recommended video they think will you will enjoy. Uh, bottom left is to sign up to the Patreon. And then uh, right next to it is the subscribe button. Hit the subscribe button. Make sure your notifications are on to get notified every time a new video comes up. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, stay safe, stay up, and peace out.